Hi Shoebox friends, welcome back. This is Denise from D. Rogers on YouTube. Today I'm going to do an unboxing for a girl two to four. The theme is red, white, and blue. And I do usually try to do a couple of these red, white, and blues um, every year. And I have the announcement of my giveaway for the stuffies that will be at the end of the video. So let's get started. This is an Operation Christmas Child Samaritan's Purse box, the plastic box. And these are really nice because these are kind of like a gift unto themselves. You can order these online at Samaritan's Purse. And when she opens her box, I have decorated the lid. It says, you are so loved. And it's a little girl in red, white, and blue. And everything inside the box is um, covered or the box is lined with a red and blue bandana. So when she opens the bandana, this is what she'll see. And let's pull this out first. This is her stuffy. <laughs> this is a cute little dog I got on Valentine's Day clearance from Walmart. He was 90% off. I think he was 29 cents. And then I have a cup for her. These are from Ikea. They're very sturdy, very good quality. And I think they come uh, six for $1.99. You can order them online or get them directly at Ikea. She has a little blue purse, red and blue purse. I either got this at Target or Walmart. And it has a little star, very cute. And when she opens her purse, she has some jingle bells that I get on Amazon. She has a red bow for her hair. Her toothbrush. These are Dr. Fresh from Walmart and the cap is from Dollar Tree. She has a pair of fun star glasses that I got after 4th of July clearance last year for 10 cents. Actually, it was 10 cents for several of those. She has a little unicorn, a little blue unicorn that I got from a set from Walgreens. And you'll see why I have a unicorn in a few minutes. Oh, and at the bottom, she has a little star hair clip. And that's my dog coming into the picture. <laughs> Okay, then on top, she has a nice red, white, and blue headband. And then this is her pencil pouch. The, this is from Amazon. And in her pencil pouch, she has a glue stick. She has three click pens, and I get these from Dollar Tree. She has a pair of blue blunt edge scissors. She has several pencils. She has these two fat pencils. These are Ticonderoga. I got these from Dollar Tree. These are easy for toddlers to grip. And then regular pencils, blue, red, white, and blue, and then stars. And then this one has this little gripper on it. You see that little gripper? These are really helpful for toddlers um, when they're learning to write for their, you know, helps their small motor skills with the thinner pencils. She has two erasers, and then she has some fun erasers. This is a, a ring that I got after Valentine's Day clearance, and she has two cute, a kitty and a dog, red, white, and blue erasers that I got from Oriental Trading. Okay, and then she has this cute little, it's called a, a teeny beanie bopper. That's really cute for a little girl this age. And I got a set of these on eBay, brand new. Um, they were all packaged up, all the same doll, and I bought it in a lot. So I do have, or I have had some success on eBay purchasing items for my boxes. 
I usually get the best deal when I buy in a lot or a bigger, um, you know, several of them rather than just one or two. And I was really happy when I got her. I got some other ones too. Um, so, okay, then my favorite item in the box is this dress. This is a Cat and Jack dress and you can see it's a unicorn and it has green and uh, not green red and blue and silver sparkles on the unicorn and the material on the bottom is like a tool on top of another layer a heavier layer so it's it's very good quality for this little girl and I bought this last year after 4th of July on clearance I did get a size 6. Usually I buy a size 4 or 4T for this age group, but I do think it's something that she can grow into and she can probably even wear now. It would just be a little bit bigger, but I just love the dress. And I had planned this box for some time now. So to go with her dress, she has these adorable red shoes. And I got these at Target, I think two years ago, waiting for the perfect box. And I think this is the perfect box for these shoes. Inside her shoes, she has an organza bag with two pairs of underwear. Usually I do a size four. And then on this side of her shoes, she has her enclosed, oh gosh, I can't get it out her pencil sharpener from Staples and I took some hair ties and I attached them to this blue and white ribbon and then in this organza bag she has some jewelry she has this little star necklace got this at Dollar Tree and then she has this necklace and bracelet really pretty it's blue and silver stars you can see that and I got these from Marshall's they came three to the set so there were three bracelets and three necklaces and there was a red one a blue one and a, um, a, a fake pearl one and I think they were like $3.99 or $4.99 for the whole set and I you can find them near the register or in the children's department. I've been pretty lucky finding some nice jewelry for toddlers at Marshall's lately. She has a little wooden spoon. She has a hairbrush. I recently found the link to these on blessingsinashoebox.com. Placed my first order and I'm just starting to use them. She has a nice white washcloth that I got from Walmart. She has a half composition book that I got, the pen and gear that I got from Walmart last year at the summer, end of year summer school clearance. She has a letter and a picture of our family, which I think is so important. Uh, one thing I wanted to mention is Emily from Love in the Shoebox just did a video on recipients and um, I too have been hurt, been fortunate enough to hear from 10 recipients this year and one of the recipients said their favorite item was our family picture and it just touched me so much so if you can be sure to include a family picture I think it helps the child um, relate to somebody who really loves them and really cares for them this little girl has two coloring books. This is from blessingsinashoebox.com. Thank you, Michelle and Christy. Has some really nice pictures and lies very flat in the shoebox. And then to match her unicorn on her dress, she has this coloring book from Dollar Tree. And I've stuck some stickers in there. And these little books are, you know, not bad. They have some nice quality pictures in here. They have some activities that I'm not thrilled about, but I think for the most part, 
They have some nice quality pictures for the little ones. There's some stickers in there, some princess stickers, some Paw Patrol stickers, some puppy and kitten stickers, and Curious George stickers. And I get my stickers either from Walmart, Dollar Tree, Target, all over really. Okay, she also has some jumbo crayons from Crazy Art. And this is a bag that I got on clearance after Valentine's Day. And then she has her soapbox from Dollar Tree. And inside her soapbox she has directions on how to clip toenails and fingernails from blessingsintheshoebox.com printable. That's free on their website. And a pair of nail clippers and a bar of soap. And then I mentioned she has her bandana that lines her box. And that's it. That's my red, white, and blue box for a girl two to four. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing. I hope it gave you an idea or two or maybe inspired you to do a red, white, and blue box. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and comment below. Let me know what kind of boxes you're working on what types of themes and ideas. Um, I love hearing your comments and hearing your ideas. And um, I appreciate you watching. And I'm going to announce the winner of my, um, my giveaway. I do this because I enjoy sharing uh, what things I have found. I have been very blessed and fortunate and I want to help others as well. And um, so anyway, I pulled this name out of the names of all the people who are interested. This person's name is Allison Carey. So Allison, if you're watching this video, be sure to email me. My email is in the description and I'm going to send you this box of stuffies. Oh, oh my goodness. And there they go. <laughs> I'm going to send you all these stuffies in the mail and I We'll pray that they find their way on their journey to a child's heart somewhere around the world. And uh, whatever you don't use that you donate to your processing center. So thanks for watching and I will see you again in another video. Thank you. Bye-bye.